It's a reality check from America's top infectious disease expert. Dr. Anthony Fauci sharing his thoughts on when a vaccine could really be available to the general public and how long it will truly take for anything resembling normal life to return. Dr. Frank George here with the timeline that we all need to hear, Frank. Yeah, Devin and Kimberly, the good news is that research is progressing well on several of the vaccine candidates, but Dr. Fauci wants everyone to understand, even under the best case scenario, getting back to normal won't happen overnight. Right now, today, in real time, you know, we're averaging close to 40,000 new infections a day and 1,000 deaths. So we are still in the middle of this. And in order to get any semblance of normality, You've got to get that baseline number of infections way down. Dr. Anthony Fauci remains optimistic about a vaccine. However, when we get a vaccine, let's say available at the end of the year, there will be millions and tens of millions of doses available. It won't be until we get into 2021 that you'll have hundreds of millions of doses. And just the logistics constraints in vaccinating large numbers of people it's going to take months to get enough people vaccinated to have an umbrella of immunity over the community so that you don't have to worry about easy transmission. But it's not going to be turning a switch off and turning a switch on. It's going to be gradual. And I think it's going to take several months before we get to the point where we can really feel something that approximates how it was normally before COVID-19. Fauci says the politically charged atmosphere makes it difficult to get people on the same page. But the recent 9-11 anniversary is a reminder of what Americans can do when they're united in a fight. We pulled together after that tragedy and really came together as a nation, which hopefully we can do now within the context of this historic pandemic that we're going through. Now, Fauci urged Americans to hunker down as we head into fall and winter to follow the recommendations on wearing a mask, social distancing, avoiding crowds, and doing things outdoors instead of inside. He stressed we do not need to shut everything down again if, if people accept the responsibility of taking precautions. Back to you. Pretty sober reading on all of where we are right now. All right, Frank.